Hyun Yuan 3, D New Chinese AI destroys Google Veo 3. Today, I'm going to show you the new Chinese AI that just dropped, and it's absolutely insane. This thing creates 3D models from just text or images in seconds, and it's completely free, while Google charges you hundreds for their stuff. I'm talking about crazy detailed 3D assets that look like they cost thousands to make. Plus, I'll show you exactly how to use it and compare it to Google's VO3. This could change everything for creators and businesses. Tencent just announced Han Yuan 3 D3.0, and they're con claiming three times better accuracy than before. We're talking ultra high resolution up to 1536 cubed. That's 3.6 billion voxels for ultra HD modeling. A voxel is like a 3D pixel. More voxels means more detail. It's like going from blurry TV to 4K, but for 3D models. Here's what makes this crazy. You type medieval warrior statue with chainmail, and this AI creates a full 3D model. Not just a flat image, an actual 3D asset you can rotate, zoom in on, and export to use in games or videos. But wait, it gets better. You can upload a photo, and it turns that into a 3D model too. Take a selfie and get a full 3D character. That's exactly what this does. How does this compare to Google's VO3? They're not competitors. They do different things. Google VO3 makes videos with audio. Hunyuan 3D makes 3D assets for games, VR, or other projects. The pricing is completely different. Google charges for VO3 through their API. Hunyuan 3D, Tencent pushes their models into open source. That means free. If you're a game developer, this could cut your 3D modeling costs by thousands. Instead of hiring expensive 3D artists or learning Blender, you just type what you want. VFX creators can make props and characters in seconds. R and VR creators can populate entire worlds without breaking the bank. Any creator who wants cool 3D stuff for content, this is game changing. The quality difference is huge. Previous versions had rough edges, weird textures, limited detail. This new version claims geometric detail that rivals professional 3D models with photorealistic textures. Creating a single 3D character takes professional artists days or weeks. With this, you're looking at minutes. The export options make this actually useful. This exports to a GLB, FBX, OBJ, all standard formats that work in Unity, Unreal Engine, Blender, everything. The texture maps include albedo, normal, roughness, all the standard PBR textures that make models look professional. This isn't toy level stuff. This is production quality. I want to test the medieval warrior prompt. Create a detailed statue with chainmail and see how the geometry holds up when I zoom in close. Then test image to 3D, take a clear photo and see if it generates a proper 3D head with realistic features. Here's the real test. Generate a model with Hun Yuan 3D, export it, rig it for animation and drop it into a game engine. See if it actually works in a real production workflow. Every AI tool has limits. What happens when you try complex mechanical parts? Hair and fur, cloth with realistic folds. From the research, they're upfront about what this does well and where it struggles. That's a good sign. They're focused on real improvements instead of just hype. China has been making massive moves in AI, not just catching up, but pushing ahead in some areas. Hon Yuan 3D is part of Tencent's broader AI strategy. They're building an entire ecosystem that works together. They're doing it differently than Google or OpenAI. More open source, more focused on creators and developers, less focused on locking everything behind paid APIs. That means more people can access this technology. Individual creators and small teams can use cutting edge AI tools instead of just big companies with huge budgets. The quality jump from version 2 to 3 is huge. The kind of improvement that usually takes years happened in months. If they can make this jump this quickly, what will version 4 or 5 look like? What happens to 3D artists when AI can do their job faster and cheaper? I don't think 3D artists become obsolete. The role changes. Instead of basic modeling, they focus on creative direction, complex scenes, artistic vision. The 3D artists who embrace AI tools and use them to amplify creativity will dominate. The ones who ignore them might get left behind. How do you use Hunyuan 3D 3.0? Multiple channels, research version on GitHub you can run locally, web interface for easier access, a PI access for developers. Local version means unlimited generations but requires serious hardware. High-end GPUs with lots of VRAM. Web interface lets regular users access without expensive hardware, but you depend on their servers. A PI is the middle ground. Developers integrate into apps, pay per generation instead of buying hardware. Game development is obvious. Indie developers could create entire asset libraries without hiring 3D artists. E-commerce companies 
could generate 3D product models from photos, real estate companies could create virtual furniture, educational creators could make interactive 3D diagrams, architecture firms could prototype building designs, product designers could visualize concepts before expensive prototyping. Because this generates actual 3D geometry, not just images that look 3D, you can use these models for 3D printing. Physical manufacturing from text prompts, demos always look impressive, the real test is when regular users generate thousands of models and we see average quality, not cherry picked examples. Version two was decent, but had consistency issues. Some generations great, others unusable. Version three claims better accuracy and reliable outputs. Consistency separates toys from tools. If you can't rely on good results most of the time, it's not useful for real work. Generation speed matters too. All the quality in the world doesn't help. If each model takes hours for real workflows, you need results in minutes. When I get access, I'll test batch generation, edge cases, export quality, and iteration speed. These practical questions determine whether this is useful or just an impressive demo. Tencent has a history of making AI models available to developers and researchers, usually within months of announcement. That's different from US companies that keep everything locked behind expensive APIs. Competition drives innovation and keeps prices reasonable. Without competition, we probably still pay thousands for basic AI access. The landscape changes fast. A tool that's cutting edge today might be obsolete in six months. Focus on practical applications. What can you build with these tools? How do they fit real workflows? What problems do they solve? When this becomes available, don't just marvel at the technology. Think about your specific needs. Where could 3D asset generation save you time or money? Start with a real problem you need to solve then figure out how to use the tool to solve it. That's how you get actual value. This is just the beginning. Version 3.0 is impressive, but version 4.0 will be better. We're riding the early part of an exponential curve. Companies and creators who start learning these tools now will have a massive advantage. While others figure out basics, you'll be building sophisticated workflows. Be realistic about limitations. This is powerful, but not magic. It requires skill to use effectively. It has failure cases where it doesn't work well. Learn what it does well and build around those strengths. Don't force it to do things it's not designed for. Hunyuan 3 D3.0 represents a major step forward in AI-powered 3D generation. Quality improvements, resolution increases, and speed enhancements make it potentially useful for real production work. Being available for free or cheap makes it accessible to individual creators and small teams who couldn't afford expensive 3D modeling before. If you're interested in 3D content creation, game development, product visualization, or cutting edge AI, this is worth watching. The real test comes when regular users get access and push the limits. That's when we'll know if this lives up to the hype. Based on what I'm seeing, this looks like the real deal. A genuine leap forward that could change how 3D content gets created. 3D is everywhere now. Games, movies, VR, AR, product design, architecture, education. Better tools for creating 3D content benefit everyone. The future of 3D creation will be fast, cheap, accessible, and incredibly powerful. Tools like this show us what that future looks like. If you wanna scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds with AI automation, check out my AI Profit Boardroom. It's the best place to connect with other entrepreneurs using AI to grow their businesses. And if you wanna make more money with AI, welcome to the free AI Money Lab with Julian Goldie. Inside, you'll get 50 plus free AI tools and 200 plus ChatGPT SEO prompts. You'll learn how to make money with AI agents, get access to 1,000 plus free NAN workflows, 200 plus chat GPT prompts, and get a full blueprint to generate thousands of leads free with AI. What you'll also get is a free AI community, free AI course, and proven AI case studies. Check it out and start making money with AI today.